Uh, this is rebuilding a uh, large, what is this, PV? Was, who, who made this? I forget. I think it's PV. Or no, or, is it Eminence? God damn it, I forgot now. Anyways, it had a uh, ceramic magnet on it. I don't quite have one that is large enough without going oversized, you know, like that, which this one's already charged, which is fine. It's still workable where I could glue it to that and then put the, I'm not gonna put that on. So, <laughs> this is gonna be hard to get this thing off. Um, uh, I don't really want it to be oversized like that. Not that, I mean, for, <sighs> Jesus. Um, it's just, uh, I can go Neo on this and that's what uh, um, Matt was talking about from Field Services. He was saying that typically, um, this is like a $500 fucking tweeter uh, horn for somebody as a replacement driver. And so what I'm gonna do is I happen to have some in, I think this is N42, and uh, I'm just gonna put them on like that. I went ahead and ground them. Uh, so they'll make a really good adhesion with the Devil Jizz epoxy. We're just gonna do four pieces and then we gotta center that on top really, really well. Um, very tight gap. It does have this thing in there. I don't understand that. I don't think that's actually supposed to be in there, but there is a groove to hold it in there. So I don't know exactly how that's supposed to work. But anyways, I'll figure it out. Uh, but anyways, it was a 20 millimeter thickness, three quarter inch. Um, that it's supposed to do and so I'm going to basically change this into a neo driver and then we'll see how it works because um, it shifted and uh, pulling it apart was uh, quite difficult and and trying to get something this precise um, back in line is very difficult because I would have to have a very exacting like thickness of say something like stainless steel or copper and I don't have those materials and so I thought it was better just to stick it on the old hot plate um, melt the glue prep all the surfaces uh, and then once I glue these on I'm actually going to go back and just give it a little light spray paint to cover some of that so there's not any rust in the future so which is fine like that and then it'll be a new neo driver that's it well again I don't recommend you guys do this but I'm just saying this is how I'm fixing this particular problem that's how I'm addressing it okay so if you can if you can do that if you have a magnetizer fucking go for it if you don't don't